Miss Bob. What are you doing, Miss Bob? Well, I already put the dry rub on our brisket, and now I'm making our artificial smoke flavor. So, what she's saying and what you're hearing is there's a lot of meat going around. Oh my gosh. We're doing a dry rub here on a nice brisket. Beautiful, beautiful brisket. Oh my gosh. And then she's making a little fake smoke going on. While that's happening, I got some jerky already cut and marinated overnight. That's what you hear. This giant jet engine is the dehydrator. So we're, uh, we're having some fun here after Christmas, making some brisket, making some brisket jerky. My famous jerky everybody loves. Everybody loves it. Except Erica. I don't do jerky. Yeah, she doesn't do jerky. But she made a really good tenderloin the other day. Beautiful, beautiful meat. So while all of that is going on, I had an order for one of my bass on smoochandrelease.com, one of my woodwork bass. So this is what it looks like. And uh, we have the pieces all cut, stained, sanded. Here they are. They'll be going together very, very soon, and it will look like this. It's gonna be a good video. Let's go. talk about Bragging Books by Brian Miller. Wow. And uh, <laughs> that's Open that, open that, open it, open it, open it. Woo! Brian, it looks like the chicken's on fire. I need a bottle of water. Get out of my It's the sausage. Wait, don't, not a grease fire. <laughs> I'm gonna show you an exercise. Not a bottle, someone gets mad. See, this is why when I barbecue, I don't usually leave the grill. <laughs> this is why we record. <laughs> I want to hear about Brian's bragging book. Okay. So what we have here is Brian's brag books. So let's go. There's Brian in a canoe when there was a flood in Long Island. 
on the corner. In the corner, literally for real. That was right outside. That's why I was about oh. <laughs> And this? Okay. Um, the jetty. The jetty? Okay. Uh, uh, sh uh, Shinnecock? Shinnecock? No, we were in Alaska. I don't know. You guys I don't want to live there. It's too cold. I'll go visit, then I'll come down and have my family in Seattle. Catfish. Catfish. That's like one of the only. I just want to welcome everybody to my garage and uh, to the Salty Boys holiday gathering. I'm glad we finally got together. We've only been trying to put together a barbecue for like six months. Um, <laughs> Like, yeah, I can't make it. Yeah, yeah I, I can't, can't make, make it. it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got a fish with my father that day. <laughs> All right. But, but hey, you know what? This is a great time of year to do it because we're not fishing. And I have venison steaks on the grill, which I have to attend to in a moment. So let's pray. Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you for the opportunity to get together tonight, Lord God. I thank you for each of the members here, Lord God, that are uh, uh, were able to come tonight, Lord God. And we pray that you just... Bless our, our friendship and our fellowship, Lord God. We pray that you bless the food and make it nourishing to our bodies. Lord, and I thank you for the friendship that you develop through the sport of fishing that you bless us with, Lord. And uh, we just thank you for all, all this season that, that we had. It was just incredible, and we couldn't ask for much better. And we pray all this in your name. Amen. 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 All right, so you guys can start eating. I'm going to take care of the steaks. You're going to run inside and get food for my mother. First, there's obviously been additions, which means there's going to be additions to the Salty Boys crew. So we would first like to officially induct Miss Erica yeah. as a member of the Salty Boys. She's a Salty Girl. Oh, girl. Yeah! <laughs> I was trying to think of a name quick. It's 2020. <laughs> I asked him, do you know, I actually asked him, I was like, so even if we weren't together and I was just a good friend of yours that fished as much as I do, would I be considered for the Salty Boys? And he's like, no. <laughs> <laughs> he actually said it without hesitation. No. He goes, no. <laughs> you said that. He said that. Salty Boy, Salty boy, in, law. Salty boy in Law. <laughs> Second, we'd like to introduce Joseph Otero. <laughs> Even though he has not fished with everybody here, he has been out s numerous times with us. He's fished yes. with Lee and, and me and Samson and the uh, happy duo over there. <laughs> <laughs> and lastly, I'd like Joe to become part of the Yes! 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 I'm Joe! This is a pivot any bigger. <laughs> so so when, when Paulie and I talked about this, what, two weeks ago was it? Mm. We talked about, you know, oh, should we do like some ceremonial thing, you know, like with a sword, like doubling them? Hazing. Like, we so should I'm haze like, them. I'm like, oh, right. no. I'm like, I have this big ass <laughs> sword in the back room, you know? I'm like, we could, yeah, we can do. So, you know what? Wait a minute. I got a, I got a little Christmas <laughs> gift. Well, I dug you, a salty boy. Yeah. <laughs> Three years ago. And this last two years was the most epic fishing with you guys. And not only that we're just friends, but we, as we fish all together, we develop a stronger bond. We get to understand one another. Like, I never got mad at Mike when Mike would be like, yo, stop, stop blowing up the spot. You know, I was like, ah! <laughs> so this is how Paulie feels. I was kidding. No, but you know what? I wasn't mad. I, I took it out. Okay, my brother's telling me, hey, just be careful. And I, I'm like, yeah, okay, no problem. It's all cool. So that's, what, that's the thing here. We might fool around, but it's, it's more it's basically like, like brothers going out together and fishing and just having a good time. <coughs> and sisters. And sister. <laughs> so, you know. As fam. Just as as fam. Like, but it's like fishing with family. The important, the bond. You know what? I never enjoyed fishing. You know, and get to know you guys <laughs> better. <laughs> because you can even ask Tony. Everywhere I go, and even if I go where the Spanish Eastern District is Salty or whatever, boy, all Salty I do boy. is just talk about you guys. <laughs> now, the fish that we catch. <laughs> People get jealous because they want to be part of, or they want to go fishing or whatever. And I'm like, you got to find your own crew. That's <laughs> good. <laughs> but, you know, it develops a bond, you know. And I thought I would never get to hug Lee or talk to Lee that much. You know, when I first met him, he was just like, so Lee, he's all the way down there. <laughs> he's always on the go. But that's good, though. That's good, though. But, you know, everybody has their own experience. And I'm just glad that I'm also part of... Uh, this awesome group. Well, I get like on the other side, 
even though I'm like his doppelganger, because everyone confuses us in church all the time. Like Brian, no joke. No, like, no. But uh, especially now with masks. I know. <laughs> but because normally I'm like I'm more into like sports. Like I'll play like like football. softball, football, whatever. <laughs> and so this year because of COVID, it was softball was canceled. Like okay, and him always talking about fishing. I'm like, well, you know what? Might as well, you know, try fishing. So talked about it enough. So like, well, it's done. This uh, one foot long largemouth bass that I made is done. You guys can get this on smoocherrelease.com slash shop. And uh, you can also purchase not just this one, which is the one foot one, the 12 inch, but you can get that one, which is about 20 inches. Or you can get both as a set. Pretty cool. Fun making it. And uh, we have some more woodwork that I personally make on the website if you guys want to check it out as well as these hats and everything. But we're going to get back to fishing really, really quick. Just wanted to give you guys this little quick update video. Super fun. If you guys enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more like this, let me know in the comment section below. But if you're new and you're looking for some fish, we do have more fish videos on the YouTube channel. So you can check it out there. Or if you want to see more videos like this, just hit that red subscribe button. We're going to have more like this as well as more fishing really, really soon. It's just really cold. We got ice. Uh, stripers aren't here. We got some holdovers, but we'll see. Anyway, guys, stay real, smooch and release, and have some fun on the water. I'll see you next time.